am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on cosine law. The question here is, the posts of hockey goal are 2 meters apart. A player attempts to score by shooting the puck along the ice from a point 6.5 meters from one post and 8.0 meters from the other. Within what angle must the shot be made? Round to nearest degree. So let's first sketch. Let us say that is the hockey post, right? Now he's shooting from one side, it is 6.5, the other one is 8. So let's say the so shot is being made from somewhere here, right? So, so that gives you the, the angle between the two. So let's say that one of the side is 6.5 meters, the other one is 8.0. This is given to us as 2. All dimensions are in meters. We have to find this angle theta. Now whenever three sides are given, side, 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 we should use cosine law, right? Now to find this particular angle theta, we can actually write the expression. We will first write representing the distances and then we'll rearrange it, right? So the side here, two square, which is opposite to theta is equal to sum of these two squares, which is 6.5 square plus 8.0 square minus two times these two, 8.0 times 6.5 times cosine of theta. So that is the cosine law. Square of a side is equal to sum of the squares of the other two sides minus two times those two sides and the included angle, right? So let's rearrange, bringing all these terms to the left side. So we get two times 8.0 times 6.5 cos of theta equals to 6.5 square plus 8.0 square minus two square, right? So from here we can write what cos theta is. Cos theta is all this 6.5 square plus 8.0 square minus 2 square divided by 2 times 8 times 6.5 right so let's use the calculator figure this out we get 6.5 square plus 8 square minus 2 square equals 2 divided by let's write in brackets 2 times 8 times 6.5 equals 2. So we get uh, 409 over 416. I didn't write it in decimals, that's okay. But the idea is to get the angle theta as cos inverse of whatever you calculated, right? Which is, in our case, 409 over 416, right? So let's do shift cos inverse of our answer and that is equal to 10.52. So this is 10.52. We have to round to nearest degree, so we could write this as 10.52 as 11 degrees, right? So 11 degrees is the answer for the given case. So I hope the steps are absolutely clear. Remember, cosine law is applied in two conditions. One of them, as you have seen here, is triple sides or when you know side angle side, right? So under these two conditions, we should be applying sine law. Thanks for watching. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. If you like and subscribe my videos, that'd be great. Thank you and all the best.